Hey everyone, it's Lisa. Happy Friday! I almost forgot about that. <laughs> I hope that you had a good week. I think I, what did I get to see you like one time this week? Oh yeah, I did. I, I showed you my hair. And today I have already been out in the rain. Let's see, I took Bridget out twice in the rain. I had to go to the mailbox. I've had to go out in the rain a couple of times. So um, last night I just curled it with the two inch curling iron and I did not sleep with it up. I just slept with it down. And so this is what I'm left with. And I've got so, you know, I've got a whole, I got a whole mess going on with all, I got a bunch of new hair and it's just, so anyway, be patient with me till I get it. it it's weird, only this little bit that I got cut off changes things and, you know, makes it different. So this week I did not get a lot of stuff. I got, let's see, I ordered one lipstick from Chanel. They had sent out a, some kind of an email where there was a bunch of limited edition colors. I'm sure you probably got that too. So I ordered this one for Denise and I, and it's the Luminous Intense Lip Color. And this one is called Luminous 179. And when I looked at it on the website, it looked like it was a lighter, more nude peachy color, but when I got it, it is a little scary. So, um, I haven't tried it yet. Oh, that's not bad. I was thinking it may be, it may even look good with like a reddish liner. But, um, I'll try this. Maybe I'll try this on. Well, I don't have anything to wipe these off. But anyway, it's, it is very pretty. I have to admit, it does have a good, good finish to it. Huh, I might end up liking that more than I thought. That might be really good with Ideal or something if I wanted to calm it down. So I got that, and it's amazing how beautiful the packaging was just for these two lipsticks. It was so pretty. Okay, speaking of beautiful packaging, got stuff everywhere. I'm going to take this lipstick off of my hand before I get it on my shirt. Okay, um, I did a little, not really a swap, but we each sent each other some of our favorite things with one of my subscribers and she sent me the prettiest package and she is a sorry a stylist in let's see I can't remember right now where she's a stylist here okay so I just texted her I said this is terrible but I'm doing my video now where do you live <laughs> because we've just been texting back and forth but anyway here is a menu of her um Things and she does closet editing for a hundred dollars, occasional shopping for two hundred, hair and makeup. A new hairstyle is a perfect complement to your clothes. I can help you decide on a new haircut and color that is perfectly suited for you, as well as product styling recommendations. Makeup consultation can be added as well. Fifty. I wish that she lived close to me because I would love to have someone help edit my closet. But anyway, I will put her information down below. She's answering now. And then this must be something, I don't know if she sells this, but I loved everything I saw in here. It's called Etc. by Invitation Only Private Showing. I love that suit. Look how pretty that is. And I love those pumps that she has on with the clear. And so, um, and then this, she sent a card. That's her cute little, that is a real dog. And just an awesome package. Pretty card, everything. So, I'm going to share with you some of the favorites that she sent me. Um, let's see. Northwest Arkansas. Home of Walmart, she said. <laughs> okay, I'll tell her thank you. Okay. So, one thing she sent me, and I have this on today, and it is, she sent me two of her summer, favorite summer fragrances. This one is called, it's Tokyo Milk 06 Dead Sexy. I love that. You know it makes me think of Austin Powers, because that's my job, half of our vocabulary and our going back and forth is off of Austin Powers. It's so funny. But this is Deep Vanilla, Exotic Wood, White Orchid, and Ebony, and it smells so good. I put it on today and it some of it came out so I've just been doing like this to get it off but it is oh my gosh it's like a creamy oh that's why the little thing was huh yeah that little thing had come out but um oh goodness I probably need another um thing but it is like a creamy um oh gosh 
I'm trying to think if you like if you like any of the tobacco scents even though it doesn't have tobacco in it but if you like any of those deep amber scents but it's like I said it's a little creamier and smoother than a lot of them are then it would be a really good one to mix with other things um, I will have to wash that off and make sure that that doesn't happen again okay and then this one is precious it is cheap and chic from Moschino I love love eau de toilette and look at this precious little thing is that not the cutest little thing I love it, it goes with my shirt today but that smells really good too this is more of a fresh scent but I'll put those down below and you can look them up on uh, Fra Fragrant Fragantica that's a good one and um see what notes and stuff are in it and here let me get all this stuff out okay and then a lot of the other stuff that she sent me I am wearing today like let me pull you in I did I tried to do a little bit different makeup today I did my old school really thick smudgy gel liner and um, these are some of her favorite lashes this is how it all started is she was talking about these and I think this and the lip combo but anyway these are the Tarte Tartist Pro lashes and these are called I'm not sure what the name of these are flirt okay flirt is the name and this is them and I don't have any mascara on them because I wanted to be able to wear them and I knew that they were going to be pretty dramatic anyway and along with I have on like Chanel volume mascara so these are the lashes that she sent me and they're so pretty and it killed me to cut them but I did cut a good little section that I can use. Brooke a lot of times likes to wear just corner lashes or I can use them on top of another pair of lashes to, you know, fix up another pair. So I always save those. Okay, and then another pair of her favorite lashes. These are gorgeous. They're House of Lashes and the style is Pixie Luxe. And I love House of Lashes lashes. They are gorgeous. I love lashes, period. That's the truth. Okay, and then the lip combo that she sent me, her latest lip combo, and she has the same coloring that I do, is the, this is the best lip liner. Really, if you don't even like lip liners, you would like this lip liner. It is pretty much the color of your lips, and it goes with so many different things. It is the good old Estee Lauder Fig, and it comes with, um, it has a brush on that side it's the roll-up kind and it comes with I believe it comes with an extra yeah it comes with the extra one and you can buy refills and people you know there's a lot of people that just have this lip liner they love it so I've got on the fig lip liner and then this lipstick these names crack me up this is Urban Decay Barfly cream and it is one of those beautiful um, light peachy light colors similar to some of the Lorac colors similar to the Bobbi Brown color that I use in the center of my lips a lot um, mod and if it's too light for you then this is a perfect color to just put in the center of almost any any lip combination it will just add so much dimension and look so pretty so love that and it feels it does feel very very creamy love that so that's what I have on today and just to kind of bring it all together I put on Buxom Celeste so that is what I have on so thank you Laura so much for that package it was beautiful and I'm going to put a picture of how it was packaged right here it was so pretty I put it on the table and took a picture to show you guys and it killed me to have to undo that wrapping because it was just so beautiful but um okay and then another thing I got this week I ordered this a while ago I think I ordered it definitely last week if not further but it is a David Lerner bodysuit and let me back out so you can see the whole thing this sucker is it is the most substantial thickest bodysuit ever but what I liked about it is I love that neckline that straight across I think that looks so good with just so many things you know just a pair of black pants a black skirt with jeans and any blazer jacket by itself I mean to me I just love it and it said it was lined and they meant it this thing is thick you could wear sorry you could wear um 
white. I mean, you could wear a white anything under this and it wouldn't show through. It is definitely double ply and really, really nice with the adjustable straps. And if you are familiar with David Lerner leggings, then you'll know what kind of quality it is. It's made out of the same fabric like leggings would be made out of. And I got the medium tank bodysuit and I will put it down below. Um, and I'll wear it soon. Today, I just wanted to wear, I've got a new t-shirt that I wanted to wear, but, and I like, it's got like some extra. See how it's got like that line? I hope you can see that going across. And it's not a thong. I would rather it be a thong, but I sucked it up and got it anyway, but it does have the snaps right here. So you don't have to pull the whole thing down every time you go to the bathroom. But um, I think this would look so good with like a pair of winter white or cream just palazzo pants or something like that. It is just so pretty. So I'm real happy with that. It was worth the wait. Okay, and then my t-shirt that I have on. This, I took the, <laughs> the Le Cube back to Oliver, to Kelly, and she wasn't upset about it. She knew, you know, that it was kind of funky. She said she got a great response on Instagram, but I told her I just, you know, I didn't know if I'd really, really use it. And um, so she had these t-shirts in and there were several different styles, but I, you guys know I love this color blue and I'm not really sure of the um, actual, I think they might be new. This is called the Rolling Stones Tour Americas and this is a small, the washed blue and it had this cool um, like big safety pin with this on it. So I don't know um, exactly what size it is, but I'll put the link down below and let me back out. But I love it. And I'm wearing it today with um, this skirt that I got a while ago. It's the current Elliott skirt. And um, he could, if he wanted to, you know, put the sleeves up. There's all kinds. If you go on uh, Pinterest and put in like rocker tee outfits, um, you'll see a lot of good ideas. But I just don't feel like stressing over keeping that up. And it would also look good with jeans and everything, but I just loved, that is so classic. I love it. I think I've had some of these in the past. You guys know I like stuff like this. But, um, so that's my top that I have on, and you see my skirt, which that's kind of old. And um, I'm gonna wear my Javiana black flip-flops today, but then tonight I'll probably put on some of my high heels, not a pump or anything, some type of um, little booty or, you know, um, ankle sandal type thing like that. So that's what I'll wear when we go out to eat tonight. And um, let's see, for accessories, I just put on these good and faithful earrings that I just got from Nordstrom with the black and the rhinestone. They're just easy to put in. And I've got my necklace back, finally. Um, with the, it's, I can't remember what it's called, but it's from Oliver and it has like the little opals in it. And I have the gold one, so I don't have to take it off. I just shower with it and everything and wear it to the beach. And then this is, I thought this would go good with this. This is the Sheila Fajal City of Angels ring. It's actually, let's see if you can, it's actually turquoise and the um, gunmetal. And then I get my nails done. I thought I was getting them done yesterday, but I'm getting them done Monday. So I don't know what I'll do. I might get something different. And um, so, and here's my hair pretty much straight. Loving it. It feels so good and so free and healthy. And I don't know, it's still frizzy because I got rained on. But so I hope you guys have a wonderful weekend. Um, maybe I'll be back soon. I probably do for a tutorial. And I will see you then. Bye-bye.